Nellie the elephant packed her trunk and trundled back to the jungle. Off she went with a trumpety trump, 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 trump. The head of the herd was calling from far, far away. They met one night in the silver light on the road to Mandalay. So Nellie the elephant packed her trunk and said goodbye to the circus. Off she went with a trumpety trump, trump, trump. <laughs> Trump! Look at all those children jumping up and down. I wonder what's happening. It's the Penny Lane School Sports Day. I'm Andy, the team captain, and you're just in time, Nelly, because we need one more player on our team. But I wonder if the judges will let an elephant play. No, she's too tall. No, she's too wide. Yes, because I'm the only judge with a whistle. And if Nellie can't play, I'm taking my whistle and going home. When they heard that, the other judges agreed an elephant on the school team was a splendid idea. Take your place, Nellie. This is the 100 metre dash. On your mark. <laughs> Should someone give her the kiss of life? Very difficult, giving an elephant the kiss of life. Uh, perhaps a, a little peck on the cheek? Oh, where am I? What happened? You fainted with the starting pistol went off. I hope you're all right. Oh, yes, I'm fine. Someone's got to do the long jump. I'll do my best, Andy. Isn't Nelly rather heavy to be jumping about? I'll be all right. I had a light breakfast. That may well have been the longest long jump ever recorded on this playing field. But as there's no sand left, I'm afraid your jump won't count. What a disappointment. Nelly felt she'd really let her friends down. If only she could make up for it by winning just one event. Never mind, Nelly. You'll do better in the water sports. Water sports? That's more like it. Nelly remembered the good old days, playing about in a pool of water in the jungle. This was her big chance. Here I come, ready or not. Oh, dear. Not a very good dive. The judges didn't give Nelly a single point. I failed again. I'll, I'll just pick up my things in the changing room and slip away quietly. Meanwhile, on the playing field, Andy and the Penny Lane team were in the tug of war contest. They fought gallantly. But they were no match for the big lads of the other school. Slowly but surely, they were being dragged towards the line. A great cry rose from the stands. We won a day! We won a day! We won a day! It's Nelly come to help us arrive! I hope I'm not too late. All together now? One, two, hee! I declare the Penny Lane Junior School the winners! <laughs> Amid the cheers and bustle of the crowds, Nellie and her new friends posed for the team photograph. As the sounds of the playing field faded away, Nelly heard another sound. It came, as always, floating on the breeze and drifting in the wind. The head of the herd was calling from far, far away. Once again, it was time for Nelly to say farewell and to travel the long road back to Mandalay. The head of the herd was calling from far, far away. They met one night in the silver light on the road to Mandalay. So Nelly the elephant 
packed her trunk and said goodbye to the circus. Off she went with a trumpety trump, 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 <laughs> trump.